all about dental veneers. Currently, dental veneers have been shown to be one of the most effective aesthetic treatments, offering better results since they correct such physical factors, such as color, shape, and size, finally making for a healthy and perfect smile. What are dental veneers? Dental veneers are small, thin, custom-made sheets that fit over the teeth and look like part of the permanent denture without being noticeable. Veneers adhere to tooth enamel by means of a special compound. They serve to change the shape, length, color, position, and surface texture of the teeth. The ultimate purpose is to improve the appearance of the teeth. What types of veneers are there? You can choose from porcelain, zirconium, composite, or ceramic veneers. Composite veneers. These are a mixture of acrylic resin with ceramic particles in the color closest to that of the tooth and in the requisite size and shape. Composite veneers are manufactured by the dentist and a highly aesthetic resin is used. Porcelain veneers. Porcelain is a type of glass ceramic reinforced with materials such as lucite, which gives it the highest possible level of resistance, very similar to the enamel of the tooth itself. For these veneers, the process is more complex, requiring that they be manufactured externally. They can be done in several sessions with the dentist. Zirconium veneers. This material is known to be very resistant and offers highly aesthetic results. However, it is often used more for dental crowns simply because they are more opaque and thicker than porcelain. How are the veneers placed? According to the American Dental Association, the way the dental resurfacing procedure is performed depends upon the type a person chooses. Full veneers generally require three visits to the dentist as follows. Diagnosis and treatment planning. At the first appointment and after an intraoral and radiographic examination, the dentist will ensure that veneers are the most appropriate treatment it is vital in this first visit that you communicate your aesthetic expectations. Preparation. Placing the dental veneer does not produce pain. However, to place dental veneers, it is necessary for the doctor to carry out a small carving on the surface of the teeth. This entails a minimal removal of the enamel, possibly the aim thickness of the veneer. This process can cause a little pain in the teeth. Placement and cementation. The first task is to clean, polish, and etch the tooth to achieve a rough surface. This allows for a strong bond between the veneer and the tooth. Cement is applied to the veneer, which is then placed over the tooth. Once correctly positioned, the dentist will apply a special beam of light to activate the chemicals in the cement, causing it to harden. The final steps include removing any excess cement, evaluating the bite, and making adjustments as necessary. What care should I take to protect the useful life of the veneers? The type of material you choose will determine the duration of the treatment. Schedule checkups with the dentist for periodic reviews. The oral hygiene you apply after placement is key. Brush twice a day, floss, and use mouthwash. Avoid smoking as it can stain your veneers. Take care to watch your diet. Thank you very much for your explanation. If you have any questions about this or other topics, you can contact us at Channel Island Family Dental as well as our Facebook page. We look forward to your visit and we will make a timely diagnosis. Our dentists in Oxnard, St. Paula, Venture, Newbury Park, and Port Hunem will be able to guide you towards the best treatment to take care of your health and give you back your best smile.